The Giving Tree by Shel Silverstein. For Nikki. Once there was a tree and she loved a little boy. And every day the boy would come and he would gather her leaves and make them into crowns and play king of the forest. He would climb up her trunk, swing from her branches, and eat her apples. And they would play hide and go seek. And when he was tired, he would sleep in her shade. And the boy loved the tree. Very much. And the tree was happy. But time went by and the boy grew older. And the tree was often alone. Then one day, the boy came to the tree. The tree said, come boy, come climb my trunk and swing from my branches and eat my apples and play in my shade and be happy. I'm too big to climb and play, said the boy. I want to buy things and have fun. I want some money. Can you give me some money? I'm sorry, said the tree. I have no money. I have leaves and apples. Take my apples, boy, and sell them. Sell them in the city. Then you will have money and you will be happy. And so the boy climbed up the tree and gathered her apples and carried them away. And again, the tree was happy. But the boy stayed away for a very long time and the tree was so sad. Then one day, the boy came back and the tree shook with joy. She said, come boy, come climb my trunk and swing from my branches and be happy. The boy said, I'm too busy to climb trees. I want a house where I can keep warm, he said. I want a wife and I want children, so I need a house. Can you give me a house? I have no house, said the tree. The forest is my house, but you may cut off my branches and build a house, and then you will be happy. And so the boy cut off all the branches and carried them away to build his house. And the tree was happy. But the boy stayed away for a long time. He came back. The tree was so happy he could hardly speak. Come boy, she whispered. Come play. I am too old and sad to play, said the boy. I want a boat that will take me far away from here. Can you give me a boat? <sighs> Cut down my trunk and make the boat, said the tree. Then you can sail away and you'll be happy. So the boy cut down her trunk. The boy made a boat and he sailed away. And the tree was happy, but not really. After a long time, the boy came back again. I'm sorry, boy, said the tree, but I have nothing left for you. My apples are gone. My teeth are too weak for apples, said the boy. My branches are gone, said the tree. You cannot swing on them. Meh, I'm too old to swing on branches, the boy said. Well, my trunk is gone, said the tree. You cannot climb. I am too tired to climb, said the boy. I am so sorry, sighed the tree. I wish I could give you something, but I have nothing left. I'm just an old stump. I'm sorry. I don't need very much now, said the boy. Just a quiet place to rest. Just a quiet place to sit. I am very tired. Well, said the tree, straining herself up as much as she could. Well, an old stump is good for sitting and resting. Come sit down, said the boy. Come sit down and rest, said the tree. 
And the boy did. And the tree was very happy. The end.